We are here in Epoch, Epoch Camp. Here, this, uh, this whole year is accommodating our refugee brothers and sisters who mostly are from uh, Indian Division and other places around Meme. So, as you can see, this is where they are sleeping. They are in this, they are about uh, 40 to 50 of them that are here in Epoch. So, as you can see, we want to do a survey so we can see if they can provide them with some uh, water system that can help them because right now they do not even have water that they can even use to drink. Uh, here, you see over there, some tanks have already been provided. Tanks are already there, but they do not yet have a borehole that can be that can maybe uh, pump them water, pump water into the tanks. You see over there, there are tanks. You see the hall. This hall too have been given. If other refugees come, they will be able to live here. And because of water, some people have left this camp and they are living in the quarters. So this is what is happening here. As you can see, there are some. The provisions are already made for taps. As if uh, a, bo a new borehole is drilled, connected to these tanks, it will be able to provide them water that they will use around this camp here. As you can see, it has uh, this camp uh, right now as it stands, they have about 40, uh, 40 people. But there are supposed to be more than that. Since there is no water, some people have gone into the quarters and if the camp is, uh, is well, if water system is provided to them, they will come back and be living in this camp. The other thing here is that uh, you can see there is a, there, uh, 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 provisions are made for uh, toilet rooms. There are toilets already, toilet rooms already, that as you can see, already constructed. They are already constructed. They are all constructed already. So if we can, it's now left only for uh, that we should uh, dig soccer ways and construct them right behind here. If we can do that right behind here, then we're, with the water system too that will be provided, I think it will be helpful because they will use the water now to flush the toilets. They will use the water to flush the toilets. From here, I am still going to look at where they can dig pit, pit toilets, if which one will be preferable. Here, you have pit toilets that uh, digging already started here for pit to for pit toilets for this camp. But because because of the nature of the soil, the soil keeps collapsing into the toilet. The soil is not the best, so it keeps collapsing. As you can see, you you. you, you the soil has collapsed into this toilet. They came and removed it and it collapsed again. So I don't know. The, so uh, it is preferably uh, to dig and, and construct septic tanks that will be used as uh, flushing toilets. There are complaints that, that their roof here has a lot of leakages and they were not able to they have not been able to sleep all this while since this August and it's raining seriously. The, the roof needs a lot of repairs. If something could be done to ameliorate the situation, then they will, they will sleep. They, I think they will have some uh, sound, sleep, uh, sound sleep, but as it stands, they cannot really sleep. You may ask, why are they not using this hall that they decided to go to that uh, to sleep? under a, roof, uh, a leaking roof. It is because the floor here is still not yet, uh, some, nothing has been done on this floor. And so they cannot leave, the, they cannot leave a, 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 a cemented floor to come, and, to come and be here, you know. It is still very dusty. That's the reason they are not under this roof. And there are no windows here. It should be noted that a fire bomb is very cold and people cannot sleep in, under this roof. It will be very difficult for them. Yeah, here we are. Now wake up. In Epoch, uh, Akwai Bomb State. This, uh, they are here as we, uh, there are more than 150 uh, refugees here in this camp. So 
you, as you as you know they do not have any source of livelihood so when they get up in the morning they try to run around go to farms to see if they can have something to eat and at this point in time you cannot see you cannot be able to get everybody so we see the children the mothers who are around those that have rushed and come back from where they went to so they are here is the camp so we, uh, <clears throat> they are really crying that they are suffering and uh, i think maybe if something could be done to them it will help them what's your name my name is felix mm -hmm. i come from Muyenge. I came. I come from Muyenge. Mm -hmm. We left Cameroon in Muyenge because of the the fighting war there, and we don't. There's no school. They burned down our village and all the schools there. So we ran down up to Akwaibom State so that we can find um, rest in Akwaibom. So um, we don't have way to go to school because we don't have any money to go to school. So our parents now they're suffering no food to eat. So we just left me and get because of the war that is happening there. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, eh? My name is Victory. Uh -huh. My name is Victory Williams Muswa. Uh -huh. I come from Bongye. Uh -huh. Southwest region. Mm -hmm. the, we, we, we ran down here because they were fighting war in our village. Mm -hmm. And they burned all the schools. They burned our house. That's why we ran down here and we escaped and ran down here. Mm -hmm. So we can come out be peaceful in this side so we don't have so we are suffering for food in this side and we don't have school to go to we don't have money to go to school that's why we ran down to this side and they burn all our school so we cannot go to school in this side and we are we are hopeless to go to school okay and we are looking for money to go to school that's why we are here okay my name is destiny Manu Mbua. i'm from Baikuke. the reason we came down here is because of the work that happened mm -hmm. We have gone down our village, we gone down our house, we have gone our school. The, the reason we came to this side is for us to come and have peace. Mm -hmm. Since we came here, we have not been able to go to school. The, my, our parents have been suffering. No money for them to for them to take care of us. Here in Ekok, uh, Epok, Akwaibom State, um, to to make a little survey on the number of children that we the uh, number of children of school age that we have in Epoch, as you can see there are there are 40 something about 41 here yeah there are 41 children here right now some have been sent by their parents to maybe to go carry out one or two errands uh, here we are at the camp this is the camp here we are so the children are here of school age but they have not been able to go to school for the past three years now my brother I don't tire. This palava don't make me, I don't tire. Hungry, they do me since morning. I never chop. I also remember my people, they were living, my picking them, my master, whether I could see them again, I don't know. And since I come for you, my picking will be bring them. No better school, no day, because money, no day. We suffer for hungry. We suffer so water no day. Place where they carry we go for a stream for inside village. We no know that side before. Toilet we no get them. Better house. See place where we sleep. Even like rats place. We don't tire. Rain before for day. We no know what we feed do. Okay, so what? Mm -hmm. Okay, so the talk say even the roof it leak yes. when rain fall. Yes. Ah, okay. Mm. That means say we no know they even sleep in peace even if rain fall. Mm -hmm. yes. You know, see how we don't pack that mattress because of rain. Okay. Mm. Okay, ma'am. Mm. Uh -huh. I did see you stand for here. They like you, you the fight for talk. What is the problem? Uh, we get friend, plenty problem. We get for talk. And I want to tell you. Like, since we will be run, <coughs> we'll find our own we will feel survive. For the EU, what we the happen for Cameroon, we will come out come for different many country for Nigeria, yeah. So we don't come for many country like strangers. Mm -hmm. so we suffer plenty. Mm -hmm. For place where we do, we don't get water if you worry we. Chop a lava to the worry we. We only suffer for chop. Especially if we don't bring our picking there. We no, we no get no uh, trouble we'll feed give them. They will not even get place we'll feed shit. Toilet the whole man so we no, we no feed no side where we'll feed go shit because we no get toilet for place where 
good day. If you worry, we I don't know even get better place where we fish stay, we fish sleep, we just sleep we for live for ground. Now when I have the thing, where we run come for here, as we come, we not get no place for sit. If we not come out, go find something where we the chop. No man enough to live here apart from God. So we do with the suffer, with the suffer. We no see no help. Apart from now, well, now we the get for now. We we the pray God say make a, give una uh, something of uh, money. We una will come help we because we we there so we no get money. So place where we the ship, uh, water for drink, everything facilities. Sometimes this uh, uh, rain, I mean a roof, it a leak. We no get no place for sleep. With a jump jump, with a ton ton, all over. Okay. Begin they know they go to school. No care of uh, medicine. In no day. No nothing. We 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 just day so. We no get no this on a come level, please. Okay. Uh in a nutshell, uh what the worries that they have expressed here, um they do not have drinking water, they do not have toilets. Yes. School is about to start and they do not have any hope of their children going back to school. They say there is a school around, but they do not have anything like money to be able to, that they will be able to send their children to school. So these are the problems, uh, the numerous problems that they are facing. And up, up there on the roof, at the roof, the roof, the roof of the house where they are living, they say it's leaking. So now, they have packed their mattresses, their mattresses on one side because they fear it may rain. So in the night, if it rains, finally you will see they will not sleep because of these uh, 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 leakages on the roof. So we pray that something can be done so as to ameliorate the situation. Problem. Problem is bad, but I went to hospital to, to check what happened to me. Then as I go there, they, they inject me. They write that my pre, my problem, problem is a fibroid. Mm -hmm. Then I, I need depression. And it's painful now. Okay. I don't know what comes. Okay. Sorry. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. What will be your name? My name is Mary Mukata. Uh -huh. Just tell me, what will be your problem? Any person, any person to take care of me. Okay. Thank you. Uh -huh. Mama, yes. your name? My name is Miss Musa. Mm -hmm. What is the problem? My husband won't leave me or no get help. I just struggle to solve her. Do it every day. So now and then we can let no get us. Okay. What is your husband? Okay, it be run for Bunaskata for Ambazonia. Mm -hmm. When will be there? Yeah. Asha. Eh, uh -huh, Mama. My name is Fred. Fred Manuel. My husband been doing me for that side. That time we fight the common. So me, I no get help. Maybe, maybe help me as for my own. At this month, so I no get any debit. Maybe just happen. Asha.